Hello everyone and welcome back to another video with me, your girl Zay, here on Zay Vlogs. So, I am showing you all the new plants that I picked up. I got a jalapeno plant, um, the red sweet bell, red bell sweet pepper plant, a strawberry plant, as well as a sweet banana pepper plant and some Roma tomatoes. Um, so the day I picked them up, I'm just showing you all that, um, the, uh, plants themselves. That's the jalapeno one. Uh, yeah, the day I picked them up, I went ahead and repotted them in bigger planters. I'm not sure the measurements on these planters, but just to get them started, I'm hoping I don't need to repot them in something even bigger. But if I have to, I'm ready and prepared to do that because I know that, um, tomatoes need space but I only got the Roma tomato so I'm going to see if I need to um repot them in larger plants but for now this is what I have them in I use the um what type of soil did I use I use the moisture control potting mix and the moisture control helps with overwatering and underwatering which I did re my research somewhere. So I specifically used that. I picked up some mulch as well, but I noticed that the potting uh, mix did come with a few pieces of mulch in it. I was gonna you know, lay the mulch around, but I did not do that. And as of this day, the mulch is not on the plant, so I haven't used it yet. I think the soil is really doing its job as far as um, controlling the moisture and whatnot. So I didn't add the mulch just yet and yeah um I didn't start from seed with these plants simply because I just figured is it too late in the season to be planting peppers and tomatoes I wasn't sure and I just really wanted something that's a little further along so that's why I went ahead and picked up plants that are already growing and that green leaf that you saw in the plant I just left from I did go ahead and snip that just so it doesn't, um, it's not in the way of the nutrients reaching the uh, larger stems and whatnot. I went ahead and snipped the ones to the left and the right here at the bottom also. And I think the one higher up, I left that one on there. But yeah, I'm just showing you all the potting mix. It is moisturized. I have my little mushroom in between just as a decor. I am growing my um, plants on my patio apartment balcony we're on the first floor um so that is pretty much my um method um what else yeah this is the jalapeno plant and i chose the plants just based off what i would probably use in the home and i definitely use tomatoes i love bell peppers next time i'm going to get a uh i do want to grow some green bell peppers but for now this is what I have. I love sweet banana peppers. I always get them on um, my sub sandwiches from Publix um, here and there. So I thought, why not grow them? Now, this is the pretty strawberry plant. It is so beautiful. Um, it has some blossoms. It'll bloom. Um, the flowers will bloom as well as the strawberries. And it's actually a, f a few strawberries here and there in between that had already started growing. So that was um, at the store. Now, I picked up these plants from Home Depot. I did not visit a local nursery, which I need to find one here in my area. But I picked up my plants from Home Depot. And as you can see, the pretty flowers that are blooming. This one looked the most healthiest to me. And it's like four plants in this one container. And it said that the container, you can grow your strawberries in this container. No need to replant. But I think I am going to go ahead and replant, repot this because it just looks overcrowded to me. Um, but let me know what you all think. Should I repot it into a bigger, larger pot or just keep it in this pot? And as you can see there, that's one of the strawberries that are already growing. And as of to this day, it's been about two to three, it's been about three weeks since I picked these new plants and veggies up. Well, new veggies and strawberry Um <laughs> I keep saying plants, but new vegetable and fruit plants up and they're still doing good. They're still thriving. I will post an updated video. This 
And that is all that I have for you guys today. I do appreciate you all watching. Please don't forget to like the video and subscribe to my channel as well as click the notification bell so that you can be the first to, to be notified when I do post updated videos as I'm growing my, my garden on my patio. And until next time, you all be blessed and keep saving. Bye-bye.